Hey, this is Mike with the Benzo Effect Channel. I hope you guys are doing great today. I'm back with a really fast, simple tutorial on how to find your main game directory. Now, a lot of people get bored with GTA Online and a lot of people get just bored with GTA 5 Story Mode. So they just want to modify their Grand Theft Auto 5. In order to get started with that, you have to find your main game directory and a lot of people just have problems doing that. So I'm going to show you how to get that pretty easy. And if this video helps you in any way, all you have to do is hit the like button and comment down below and subscribe if you're new. So we're going to go ahead and get started here, guys. Now, it depends on how you bought your game. Did you buy it through Steam? Did you buy it through Epic? Or did you just download it from Rockstar? So I'm going to show you how to find the pathways really simple, really fast, and really easy. So on your screen right now, you're going to find three of the most common default pathways of where your Grand Theft Auto 5 directory is. Now, if you've already installed this on another drive, another folder, things like that, chances are you already know how to get there. So this video is not for you. This is for people that are kind of brand new to the game or people that just don't know how to get to their main game directory. So the first pathway is going to be for Steam users. The second one is going to be for Epic Game users. And the third one is going to be for Rockstar Retail users. So we're going to go through each one of these step by step. It's really fast, simple. I'm going to show you how to do it. Okay, the first pathway I want to show you is for Steam users. Most people that are watching this video probably already purchased this through Steam. So we're going to go ahead and get started with them first. You can see the pathway that's on your screen right now. So what we're going to do is go to File Explorer. Just go to your C drive. And then you're going to go to Program Files times 86. You're going to go to Steam, and then Steam Apps, and then Common, and then Grand Theft Auto 5. That is where your game is located at. Okay, a real quick pro tip you can do for Steam users is pretty cool, is pull up Steam, go to Library, then go to Grand Theft Auto 5, left click, make sure it's highlighted, right click, go to Properties, and then go to Local Files, and then press Browse. Now my particular pathway is going to be a little bit different than yours because I have it installed on a different drive and a different folder. But I just wanted to kind of point that out so that way you guys can get to your actual local files a little bit easier through Steam. Okay, for the next pathway I'm going to show you how to get there for Epic Games users. A lot of people ask me this question for Epic Games because they downloaded it for free from Epic Games. So I'm going to show you how to do this now. So what you want to do is go to the C drive. You're going to go to Program Files. And then you're going to find your Epic Games folder. And then you're going to see GTA 5. Simple as that, guys. Okay, for the third pathway I want to show you is for Rockstar retail users. And what I mean by that is they actually went on the internet. They went to Rockstar Games and downloaded it that way. So I'm going to show you the default pathway for that. You're going to go to your File Explorer. You're going to go to C Drive. You're going to go to Program Files. And then you're going to go to Rockstar Games. You find that folder. And then you're going to find Grant the Auto 5 right there. Okay, guys, this is going to go ahead and wrap up today's video. I just wanted to show you where your default pathways are for your Grand Theft Auto 5 installation. And for more simple, fast install tutorials and things like that, what you want to do is hit the like button and subscribe if you're new and hit that bell notification whenever I upload new content. Thank you, guys. Have a great day and stay safe. Thank you for watching Benzo's YouTube channel. Be sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. Benzo uploads often, so stay tuned for the next episode.